Sorry, I'm back. Go on. Mm. I'll ask you to be here. Oh, no one. Mm. Well, there you go. So if you don't mind, I've got things to do. Yeah, like what? Like, um, why are you smiling? What is that? Is that reverse psychology? Is that it, what that is? Is it working? Not so much. Mm. Listen, I don't need a nanny or a nurse. Are you okay? Ladies. Fabulous. What? Oh. Oh no, that's good. Good timing, because maybe you can talk some sense. What's wrong? You remember in, in The Wizard of Oz when the, the house fell on the wicked witch? Yeah, it almost happened to me. But it wasn't a house, it was just a section of the roof. A, a company, I know I saw that. Yeah. I was, I was uh, coming down the stairs and I fell and, and it missed me by inches, but it wasn't luck. What happened it goes against everything I, I've ever thought. Like uh, voting for a Democrat? Look, I, uh, I won't blame you for doubting this. I, I doubt it myself, but you're the only two people I could tell who wouldn't think I'm crazy. And I want you to convince me that I'm not. <laughs> Go ahead. Don't, don't, don't encourage him. Livia, if I'm crazy, you'll know. Don't just dismiss this. Let him talk. So you were in an accident? And, you know, maybe you hit your head? No, 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 no. It, it wasn't an accident. All right. All right. I'm lost. We're trying to understand, you know, what... Well, I, I couldn't tell Rafe or, or Buzz or the doctor, but... But, uh... But what? This is what happened. I, I was on my way to a meeting, an important meeting. I was walking down the stairs. And you tripped and fell. We got it. No, I didn't trip. Someone grabbed my leg and I tripped down the stairs. So you think someone was behind you? Or maybe somebody left something on the stairs? No, nothing. There was nothing. Someone grabbed my leg, a hand. I fell down the stairs, and if I hadn't fallen, then the roof would have crushed me. And this is the crazy part. I think I know whose hand it was. Gus. You've seen him? <laughs> All right, stop. Really, stop it, okay? You, you guys want to go do a seance or, or a, a, make a call on the Ouija board, that's fine, but do it somewhere else. It was Gus. He touched my shoulder and he started talking to me. Alan, understand this. Gus is dead. He wanted to assure me that everything was going to be all right, but he, he needed something. He wanted something more. No, listen, you guys never had two civil words to each other when he was here on this planet, okay? He's not going to come back from the dead to talk to you. He was there to reassure me. He told me that everything was going to be all right. He wanted something. He needed Gus something. Gus is dead! He said he's coming back. He has more to tell us. No, Alan. Well, you can't buy this. You can't be buying this. I think he has some unfinished business. No, Gus is dead. Okay? You, you can smell his aftershave all you want. That doesn't mean he's coming back. Well, how does that explain what happened to me? I don't explain me? anything, okay? I just know that the last piece of Gus exists in here. Get out! All right, I'll get out. But that's not going to change what I saw and what I heard. What if... No. No. Go! You don't even need any painkillers because where it counts, where it really counts, you can't feel a thing. Shut the door on your way out! Thank you!
Is this Barry's books? Did you deliver? Great. Um, I need some books, and I thought maybe you could help. Coming up on Guiding Light. I had another dream. <laughs> what does 512 mean to you? That's the amount of home runs Ernie Banks hit. I counted that seven times. That's 512 $20 bills exactly.